Welcome back to Pandora's Box. We're continuing on with Antonio. I contact the Oxford administrative staff. They told me that Dr. Harvin's working on an expedition off the coast of Albania. I've set up transportation to get you there, but I'm afraid this might not be as simple as we'd hoped. We got word of a problem. Oh, no. And that is, the lady I talked to at Oxford also mentioned that we weren't the only ones looking for info on Dr. Harvin. Others have been asking questions, and they discovered an intrusion into the administration's database sometime yesterday. Suffice it to say, I don't think we're going to be the only ones looking for Dr. Harvin. I think you're going to need to hurry. Okay, well, where am I going? Independence Port. Oh, goody. Okay, thank you. Uh, to Independence Port we go. I have not done a badge hunting thing for that yet. Mm. Paragon monorail system. I'm literally recording all of this on the 4th of July because I was bored <laughs> and feeling pretty good. I'm not going to lie. I was like, going, okay, what am I going to do today? And I, I was a week ahead on videos, so I was like, going, let's get ahead on the next week. I'm really bored. <laughs> Uh, I'm going Independence Port North because all the boats are right there. I watch it to be south that I need to be at. And I will reload the tram if it's in the south because that's the biggest zone in the game. No, well, not really. Uh, the, some of the uh, <coughs> Shadow Shard dimensions are bigger. No, oh, that's right next to me. Cool. We'll get on the boat. I believe that's the boat with one of the um, task forces. Right here. Yep, there's a task force right here. Lady, Lady Liberty, formerly Statesman Task Force. And let's do this. Why is that in my head again? All right, locate Harvin. Oh no, there is no map available out here. He's inside, isn't he? Okay. Archaeological gig. Dig. Do I have a map in here? I do. All right, so I'm gonna reveal it. See who's after her. Whoa, they don't con. So. Oh wow. Hey guys, that woman gave me the creeps. I think we need to leave like now and just depend on the whole project. I don't know. D cool. Archaeologist. Awesome. I almost was one. You think they're here for the professor? Beats me. I've never seen them before. Them? Who are we talking about here? I'm going all the way down here, aren't I? And then I'm going to have a whole thing full of Oh, no. Yeah. Okay. Well, I haven't seen you since, um, <clears throat> uh, I located Harbin, all right. Hold on. I don't like her because she's psychic. All right. If you hear explosions, again, this is the 4th of July. I'm sorry. You're also squishy, so if I can get you gone, we've got competition. Take her down. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. This is becoming a problem. I'm calling her in. Calling who in? Uh, are you a hero? Did you come to save us? Fear and hope flash across the student's face as he tries to gauge whether or not you're a threat. He's clearly not in a stable state of mind. Uh, well, what's going on? What did that woman want with Professor Harvin? This is too freaky. Did you see those guys? Who dresses like that? Get out, kid. You've never heard of Arachnus? Calm down. I need you to tell me who Dr. Harvin is. There we go. The student recognizes you as a hero and appears visibly relieved. I, I think... I've seen you on TV before, right? Professor Harbin's deeper in the cavern. He once wanted to map out the cavern so that 
we could start excavating. The woman wasn't the only one after him. She said uh, more people. She had more people with her. Please, you have to help the professor. I'm on it. Get to a safe place. Get out of here, dude. Okay, this doesn't bode well because I used my freaking thing before I was ready. Oh, good. Who? Arbiter Sands. And is that who I think it is? It is. That's James Harbin. All right. All right. Um, Sands, come on. We're not going to repeat fault line, are we? Okay. You want to repeat fault line. That's cool. How very bothersome. Yeah. And just like fault line, you leave your guys behind. Okay. What's the meaning of all this? Dr. Arvin appears to be somewhat flustered, but otherwise unharmed. Arachnus probably wanted him for the same reason you do. Now, see here, young lady. I, young? I, again, I'm far older than you. Uh, I demand to know what is going on here. We are here on a licensed expedition, and if you people think you can intimidate us into... <sighs> if Dr. Arachnus is looking for you, I'm here to help. Arvin looks has a look of indignation turns to, to momentary doubt. Did you say Arachnos? Oh dear, I suppose I should have seen this coming. If they're here for me, then they must have been searching for Pandora's box. You see, I happen to be the foremost researcher of the field of... I know, Doctor. I need you to get get you out of here. Oh, oh yes, of, co or, of course, of course. I'll follow you out. Do you do be careful, young lady. I've heard Arachnos is quite dangerous. Uh, yes, uh, thank you for the warning. Oh, great, it's a flipping escort mission. Oh, I'm glad I'm a tank. I can get him out of here, I hope. But every moment I've been talking to him is probably... Yep, that's what I was afraid of. Guys, look, you don't stand a chance here. And my problem is I just ran out of my power. Oh, that's good. I'm not going to suffer for it much. Poke. This is more than one group. Let's pop this one. Ja. Dr. Harbin. I just got to keep an eye on his health. He's pretty good so far. Let's go. That was a large group. But that's because there's more than one group. Oh, man. They populated the whole thing with people. Great. I could run to the end, but I don't know what's waiting for me at the end. Plus, I want the XP. I'm not going to lie. This is one of those grinding situations, but I can't help but do it on camera here. <laughs> Hi, dude. And pop. Got him. Next. <sighs> Always take out the psychic first. These guys, if I were a squishy, I would take out them first because they do hit kind of hard. But I'm not a squishy, I'm a tank. Suck it, nerd. Wabba. Oh, well, that was a whiff. Next. Dr. Harvin, I hope you're enjoying the show. It'll be over soon. We're almost out of here. I swear. All right. Let's get you out. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, this is not good. Okay, I got my thing back, and I can do this. Let me get rid of this. Move this to here. Move this down. All right, let's have a talk. Oh, shoot. Blah, 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 blah. What? 
So this is why you could not accomplish your task. You did well to summon me. Things have grown in quite a thorn on our side, yet she is no match for the three of us. It's time for us to end this farce. I'm going to enjoy tearing you to pieces. Well, this doesn't seem fair at all. What the frick? I mean, I knew Arachnos was low, but this is downright sad. What the? Uh, uh, they don't seem interested in fighting. Fair. Do you, you should even the odds? Wait, what? Oh. Oh. I like the way you think, girl. It's about time we got proactive. Cool. Um, I will take on Nocturne. <laughs> you guys take out, uh... Um, and I'm gonna do this and this. Alright, cool. I don't like this one bit. Can I get out of this? No. Oh, shoot. Come on, get Nocturne out of this. Because she's the second worst one. Okay. I think they already took him out. Uh, Ghost Widow, you're next. Oh. You're the only one left. Cool, they took out Sans. <laughs> oh, oh, yes. Oh, oh, that was a mistake, Ghost Widow. He's not the tank. I'm the tank. You should have been uh, prepared for me again. I did not know I was going to face her again. Oh, okay. Speak with Positron. Positron's outside? Ooh. Huh. And you're able to provide the resource. Okay, he's promising to keep him safe. Okay, Positron. Hello again. I hope you didn't mind the interruption, Mr. Nash. Let me know where you were headed, and we detected some arachnos activity shortly after you left. It seems clear to me, given the resources they've devoted here, that arachnos views Pandora's box as high-value target. I am mobilizing the phalanx to react accordingly. Any time arachnos rears its head, I intend to be out in force to stop them. For now, though, I'm simply glad that you managed to extract Dr. Harvin safely. I believe he is prepared to work with us towards a common goal of locating the box. We've discussed the ramifications of Recluse reaching the artifact first, and I believe we've come to an understanding. Okay, good to hear it. I must say, I did not expect my savior to be so well associated with the Freedom Phalanx. I'll say to you what I said to Positron. If you have the resources available to enable my research and you can vouch for my safety, then you'll have my utmost cooperation. This may be the best chance I have of completing my life's work, to see the legendary Pandora's box with my own eyes. Why, I can hardly wait to get started. <laughs> Glad to have you on board. I'll make sure Dr. Harvin has the appropriate accommodations. Arachnos apparently has the same information on his career that we do, so it would be safest to keep him inside Fort Trident for now. I'll f forward any pertinent information we obtain to Tony for you to follow up on. Good work out here. To be brutally honest, I'm not sure the Phalanx is capable of handling this kind of crisis on its own. I'm glad to have you on the case. All, all part of the job, right? Yep. Cool. Let's talk to Antonio. We got one more part of this. Wow. I had to fight Ghost Widow again. I wasn't prepared for that <laughs> that could have ended really badly all right let's contact him i'm not sure how much uh, oh what huh uh what wait what uh call oh okay well before i hit anything here i'm gonna end this episode i'll see you guys in the near future thank you for watching and i'll see you soon